If you've been in a store this week, you've probably noticed there's a long line for gift returns. Yeah, now before you hit the return button, Cornelia Nicholson joins us now in the studio with tips to make those returns easily. Cornelia. Cindy David, the Better Business Bureau says the most important thing to know when returning a gift is what the vendor's return policy actually is. Now, Michelle Mason with the BBB says not every policy is the same and businesses are actually not required by law to have a return or exchange policy. She says it's really important that people know the return policy before they purchase a gift and that they're okay with whatever the policy is. She says the main concern that they see is for the same for online and brick and mortar shops. Do your research on the return policy. We get used to very lenient policies from some of the larger retailers and sometimes assume that's going to apply to anyone and that's not always the case. And certainly with custom type gifts, it's understandable there could be a restocking fee if there's a reason that you need to return it or have to cancel an order. Mason says to check in advance how much the fee would be for restocking or return shipping before you purchase a gift. She says make sure you know what the deadlines are for returns or with some popular electronics, they may actually not be returnable at all. She says these are things to know when looking to return a gift. For more on holiday scams, you can visit our website, local3news.com.